Hey, what's going on guys? Bridge Fusion here and today I'm with you for another video and today's video is my WWE Minecraft Arena of Backlash 2023 and it is here at the Clisio del Puerto Rico Arena and I am so excited to show you this because it's a little bit different to the other arenas that they do show off. So let's waste no more time and get straight into it. So here is the front of the arena itself. So down here the fans will enter the arena. And then I'm only going to show you one side just because they're both the exact same. But yeah, we do have this part of the arena of the side. And then we do also have the roof going on up there as well. And then down here we do have the side of the arena with the windows coming out and I believe under here would probably be like emergency exits or something like that and then on the side here is the other side to the arena where it would come out like and probably more entrances and exits and then we do have the back of the arena just right here where it's mainly going to be for the like WWE superstars where they will get into the arena so for us to get into the arena we'll go down this road and then all the way down here and then straight down again into the parking lot so it's a little bit different this backstage area so i'm gonna quickly show you that so we do have the locker rooms for single occupancies probably for like cody rhodes and brock lesnar um so yeah we got this one right here and then down here we do have two more that looks the exact same just like this with the TV and a place to get changed and then down here we do have the medical room so if you do get injured you can come in here and be seen too we got a load of cabinet space for like any medical equipment that they may need to use and then over here we do have the meeting room so if they did need a meeting before the show they can come in here and they got TVs if they need to do like any presentations and then down here is the general manager's office. It's a lot bigger than I usually do, but it still looks really cool. So we do have the like little seating area right here where they can watch the TV. And also right here where probably Triple H can talk to the stars themselves. And then if we go down here, we do have the female locker room, which is just right here. So, so everybody that doesn't have their own locker room can come in here. And then they do have their own toilets and showers and then down on this side we do have this bit blocked off because you can't actually get out into the arena that way because it's blocked off basically and then yeah we do also have like a little storage area if needed and then just down here is the male locker room so it's the exact same as the women's with the toilets and showers and place to get changed as well and then the last thing to show, we do have the interview area. So up here would say Backlash. And then we do have all of the other designs around there. So yeah, you can get interviewed right here. And then let's get to the main bits itself. So we do have a little mirror so you can check yourself out before you go out. And then we're going to go through this red curtain. And here we are inside of Gorilla Position. So yeah, you'd have probably Triple H possibly Shawn Michaels and the other like producers in here and if you're waiting to go out you can sit here watching the TV ready to go out so we're going to go through this current now into the arena in three two and one boom here we are outside inside of the Clisio de Puerto Rico arena ready for WWE Backlash 2023 so first off here we do have the wrestling ring itself with all of the puerto rico colors but more importantly the design for the ww backlash pay-per-view ple shall i say itself and then over here we do have the announcers table they did have the puerto rico announcers team and obviously the english announce team and then down here we do have the timekeepers area and we do have the main camera that does look onto the ring just like so. And then above the ring, we do have the lighting rig with the big screens as well. I know it's called B Lash, but it's just because of the size of it that I couldn't write Backlash. So I was trying to write like back, like BAC, and then try to make it smaller. But I thought B Lash 
is probably the best bet to go with that one, which looks pretty darn cool. But the main reason you're probably here today, guys, is to see the stage itself. So I'm going to show you that in three, two, and one. Boom. There is the stage. It looks pretty cool. It was quite difficult, if I'm honest, but with the size of it, that is probably the best I could have done with that one. So yeah, it does come out with the screens right here. Here would say Backlash and here would say Backlash as well. And then it would have like sort of like the Puerto Rico flag right there. And it does have the lights going down here as well. And then yeah, let's have a little look around the whole arena just so you can take it all in for the entire build itself. But yeah, I do really like it. I would love to know what you guys think down in the comment section below. If you do like it, please make sure that you do smash that like button. And if you haven't already, please make sure that you do subscribe. And if you'd like to check this out for yourself, make sure that you do check out the download link down in the description below where you can download it for yourself. And also make sure you do check out the playlist link down in the description below so you can see all of my wrestling arenas that I have built in the past. But yes, once again, guys, I've been Bridge Fusion. I really do hope you like this video. Leave a comment and subscribe for more. Peace out, guys.